In this video we want to explore the orientation of the part, physical part, to the CAD model. Now here's my issue. I bring in this um, part model and it is not correct to the way I need to set it up on the CMM. So before I begin writing my program I need to orientate the CAD model to the way it's going to set on the CMM. And here's the way we do that. Notice in the import export ribbon bar there is an alignment key. I find it's advantageous to rotate the part to match how I want it sitting on the CMM. Come to this alignment and I want to level this part on this face. Now you see it brought the CAD model orientation to the face, but my CMM orientation is still out here in space. Now to sync the two, let's go to Sync CAD. Don't make any changes here. We're not going to add it to the program. We're just going to click OK. And as you can see, it brought the alignment together. Now, Z is pointing through the part here. I want a Z to point straight up. So I am going to rotate about Y 90 degrees. If I hit apply here I can preview my selection. Maybe it should have been minus 90. I could make the change here and so long as I keep hitting apply I can preview my change. It's only when I click OK that change is accepted. So I click OK. And now I need to sync the CAD. Alright, now let's view it in its proper orientation. Let's pan this so we can see. Now I'm going to set the origin on this feature right here. I don't need to set X here because that's set on the plane. So I only want to set X, uh, Y and Z origin in that hole. Click OK. Once again the CAD moves to the proper place but the CMM's origin is still right here. Let's sync CAD. Again, don't add this to the program, just click OK. Now my part is in the correct orientation of the way I'm going to set it up on the CMM. And now I can start writing my program.